This vlog is a hectic to do and to buy list. This is my third time packing up my life and heading to South Korea. There's so much that I've learned that I needed to do that I wouldn't have known if I didn't do it two other times. So I hope you find this video enjoyable and helpful. The very first thing I do is I create a list of things that I'm going to buy over on Amazon. <laughs> And it's full of things that are either not really found in Korea or extremely expensive in Korea in comparison to where I live, which is America. Makeup, that's my favorite. I just stock up on it, especially foundation. Often they use powder-based products that are like this, this one, the dabby one, not liquid, but they're like more powder foundations and I just prefer liquids, especially the darker your skin tone gets. It's really hard to find that overseas. But for skincare, I would really recommend you take travel size versions because a lot of brands that you love in America are often in Korea, not always, but I would recommend that you just bring travel size because you can probably find something that is equivalent, if not better here in Korea. And it's not worth like taking up a ton of space in your luggage. Save that for like snacks that you can't buy. Gotta have my Chick-fil-A sauce or avocado oil. Avocado oil is usually extremely expensive in Korea and toothpaste is so important that you buy this ahead of time because a lot of toothpaste in Korea, they don't have like the fluoride that your teeth are used to. And so I always stock up on toothpaste and deodorant. Yes, you can find deodorant in Korea. It's available, but I got sensitive pits, okay? And they only like certain deodorants. So I also always stock up on those as well. Most of the time I buy everything off of Amazon, but I always save like a few things to go and buy in person because like, did you really go on a trip if you didn't go to the store and buy it and like, you know, put it in your little cart? It just doesn't feel the same to buy it all off of Amazon. I just like to save a few things for the Walmart trip and some of those would be like snacks or medicines. And this is like a huge tip if you wanna save some money. In the store, you'll find like, here's the name brand of like Tylenol, but then to the side, there's gonna be like a store brand version and it's the exact same ingredient. If you look at the back of the bottles, it's the same, it's just one has a different dress on. So one way to save money is just buy the store brand because it's literally the same medicine. Now we checked off the to buys, now we gotta stick to the to do's. Warning, this part of the vlog is very chaotic, but it's probably my favorite part. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I'm in such denial. Okay, okay. Yep. Oh. Oh, I thought that's a date of birth. Sorry, it's today. Yep, yep, that's good. That's good. I didn't tell her that this is my 959 millionth COVID test. She explained the whole process. CBS, you're doing great. It is 10. 24 right now we'll see when i get this back it is a pcr test which can take two to three days but i was just a little apprehensive about is the naat test going to work so i will let you guys know for sure if the naat test is acceptable from walgreens and how quickly those results come back now i gotta go get my glasses and do a whole bunch of other errands because holy crap there's so much to do because megan whether or not you believe it you leave in two days i am in such denial glasses Look at him. Look how cute he is. Hold on, let me look like him. Well, I can't, I can't open my eyes. I have contacts in. Do we look alike? We're at Walmart. We bump in here in Walmart. Medicines and random sauces, check. Check, check. Checkity check, got him. Am I very dehydrated? Check. Drink water, folks, stay hydrated. Don't be dehydrated like me. Mm. This is why we can't have nice things. Here we go again. Hi, I'm taking a COVID test. Thank you so much. Have a great day. You too. I definitely gave them snot. <laughs> I pulled that thing out and was like, there's a booger. They were like, I didn't ask for that. It's not my fault. It just came out. <laughs> But we did it. I leave tomorrow. I feel emotions. Have I finished packing? Of course not. No. Who do you think I am? Unless everything's done extremely last minute, I'm not myself. I gotta be me. Now I'm off to buy what I think is one of the most important things that you buy in advance, which is a bra. If you're a woman, or a guy, maybe you're into bras, but if you have a chest, undergarments are just better to buy in advance. Like hands down, it's just better because especially for like the top part, if you are a little larger, like I really don't know how many bras you're gonna be able to find. One last time. Reference anybody? Dunkin' has like a special place in my heart. It's like how I got introduced to drinking coffee. People are probably like, ooh, 
of all the places, but I like it. I don't know. I have very low expectations though, every time. Cause the drink is different every time. It's always different degrees of watered down. The sweetness level can go from like semi-sweet to like, whoo, sugar cane. Anyways, we're at Kohl's. You can't see it. Co, we're at Co's. My mom came to meet me guys because you need a second opinion. A wild mother in her natural habitat shopping. <laughs> I love it. Cute. Look. No. This lady referred to as a maiden. You sound asleep. <laughs> I got my support. I got my support system. Right here. My support system with my new support. <laughs> love you too. My coffee. Now it's time to go get my hair trimmed because you can actually for very cheap get your hair cut overseas but whenever there's a language barrier there's just something that's a little off or they do something i wasn't expecting the worst is layers like my hair can't do layers it looks like a kindergartner like took scissors to the back of my head if someone tries to put layers in my hair so to talk to someone and just be able to have a fluent conversation not worry about any language barriers i always try to get my hair cut as close as i can to my flight can we just talk about how beautiful this little this this moment is that we're having right here. I wish you could see how pretty the trees are, but get brighter. Oh, frick. Oh, frick. Ah, what's happening? <laughs> They're a much brighter pink in person, but we got her trimmed up. Looking nice and healthy, aren't we? And now the next part is probably the most important, but it's almost like the hardest to do. Live in the moment for a few days. Put a pause on packing. Put a pause on thinking down the line. What do I need to do next? Where do I need to go next? And just take a few days and set them aside to either be with those you love or do things that you love. Because when you do move overseas, there will be days where you wish you could go back and do those things that you love. So don't forget to be with those that you love, do things that you love. And here's me doing that with my loved ones. Oh no. Deactivate our <laughs> smoke. <laughs> it fits! Cinderella! Wow. Cinderella! 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 Oh. You can be the ugly subsister. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's not working. It's not Good. on. Let's go. Go. <laughs> See ya. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Goofy photo time. <laughs> <laughs> Moving overseas is insane. I have a bunch of vlogs doing that and my family's kind of crazy. So if you want to laugh at us, there's that option too.